Stephen, focus. Stephen. What? Hi. I'm Danielle Flynn. We are live in Lapeer for City of the Week. Joel is currently in the Lapeer Arts Association exhibit. We are, this is all part of the Center for the Arts home of Gallery 194 and Pigs Theater, which is a mouthful. I actually have a cheat sheet business card because I was worried about fitting all that in. They got a lot going on here in Lapeer. Joel is in front of an amazing piece of work from an artist named Dan Doherty. And what is this? This is Tumbling Dice! Tumbling Dice! It's like they knew we like, were coming. Like the Rolling Stones, the Tumbling Dice. If you bring Look it back, I know I'm going to be If I break just... it, I owe Dan $200. All right. Pretty well, bad. let's just not break it, and then we won't have to worry about writing checks that are going to cool? Tumbling Dice. And, yeah. and Joel, yes. but, uh, actually, um, Rolling Stones aren't the only connection in Lapeer. Uh, Grand Funk Railroad. We play Grand Funk Railroad here on WCSX. And one of the main Grand Funks, uh, Terry Knight, he was the producer. He's from right here in Lapeer. You know, they named Grand Funk Railroad in kind of honor tribute to the Grand Trunk Railroad that runs right through Lapeer to this day. Except for today, it's known as Grand Stuck Railroad Dude. because the train is blocking all of downtown Lapeer. But so WCSX is unstoppable. Lapeer, you people have the patience of Canadians. I don't even know what to say. Like, Aren't the they great? Train stops for Aren't half great? an hour in the middle of the day. They're like, all just hanging out. Well, well I guess oh, we're stuck for actually, a while. No, no. The, you can tell the locals. We actually followed them, which is how we got here. Because everybody started taking yep. rights. And we're like, do that. Don, right. I got to I gotta take a break. I'm going to be right back. Right. Tumbling right. dice. Okay, yeah. tumbling dice. Tumbling dice. Rolling stones. All right. So, really cool art gallery. I like the vibe here. Super nice people on top of it. And they've actually got several exhibits, uh, as the name would suggest. There's a lot going on inside of the Center for the Arts, home of Gallery 194 and Pigs Theater. So, we just saw the Lapeer Art Association uh, exhibit. Now, this is Gallery 194, and they were telling us that... Um, a lot of this artwork is actually done by a couple of artists that are getting ready to get out of the artist business. So this is kind of like their swan song. And all of these feathers that you see on the wall, Stephen, if you can zoom in on this, these feathers, so they are actually made of wood. If you look down here, you can kind of see where it's almost like a shaving, but the lady makes them out of wood. Just amazing. Like I would never guess. I would totally think that was a regular feather, but a lot of the feathers that she does are from birds that well, it would be illegal to have their feathers because, yes, that can happen. All right, so now we're heading over to Pix Theater. This is a cool space, man. Talk about having an amazing open mic night or something like that. What a Do you hear it? Do you hear it? It's open mic day with Joel Morgan. Do you hear that? I don't have a light. Baby, I should be clicking a lighter right now. Oh, oh, baby. Call me the tumbling dice. And it all ties back in together, people. Tumbling dice. We're live in Lapeer. Woo! Woo! Pick's Theater. 94.7 WCSX City of the Week. He's so good. Baby. <laughs> baby? <laughs> oh, that's a throwback. <laughs> I'm a throwback. <laughs> 